All right, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy Boss Money here from Chirac News. All right, so I'm just going to make a little quick video on the exact death site of uh, Front Street Blood Money. Um, basically, it's going to be a branch off of my last video about MLB Scrap. I talked a little bit about uh, Blood Money in that video. So uh, Blood Money was Chief's Keef's cousin. I'm not going to get too much into his background. Um, I know I told you in the last video you can go watch that uh, MLB Scrap and KI were the ones responsible for his death. Um, apparently, I could be wrong. STLKI might not have had something to do with that, um, but I know 100% positive MLB Scrap did. And I know there were two people on that shooting, um, so don't quote me about the KI part, but I just I know she got killed two days after uh, Blood Money did. And, I mean, on the streets, that, that that's just what I heard. But, like I said, I could be wrong about that part. So, um, yeah, I'm just going to get right into the uh, location. I'm going to try to keep this short and sweet for you all. All right, so if you guys read the uh, Chicago Homicide Watch online, it's, it says uh, it was the 5600 block of uh, South Elizabeth where uh, Blood Money got killed. So it really wasn't anywhere in this hot spot like uh, Woodlawn, Washington Park area. It was still fairly close, but I would say like a quarter mile away, but it was uh, more over here in like the Inglewood area. So we'll zoom right in. It was still fairly close, I guess, to Front Street and MLB. Um, but yeah, man, uh, we'll zoom right into 56 in South Elizabeth right here. It was literally right on the corner too, but um, I don't I don't know if any bodies blood money really has. He was I thought he was just more of just like the OG getting money, uh, you know what I mean, fucking drug dealer and shit. But uh, I mean he was thirty, so he's had to class like he he was from Front Street, man. It's blood money from Front Street, and I run shit. Got a dope line and a coke line. They dumbers, man. So you know he had clashed with MOB a bunch in the past, but uh, I think this was more just like out of jealousy and out of uh, basically. To get clout and shit, man. Like, you, you kill blood money, you're gonna fucking get your name in the streets. So, it's definitely gonna get you a lot of clout if you get, if you get catch blood money, man. Um, but yeah, this is basically where they got him, man. Right here. Uh, right on Elizabeth. This is the corner of 56 and Elizabeth. But I think it was, like, literally right in front of this house right here, man. Somewhere, uh, I heard he was just in a, was chilling out in front of a car. Talked to some people. And they came by and lit this shit up, man. Like, 30 shots, man. There were hella shell casings down the road. But literally right here on this corner, man, somewhere. I believe like this is the exact spot right here. It could have been down a little bit more. Um, somewhere like around this spot. But like I said, I, I really think it was right at this corner here. But yeah, man. Uh, it's sad, man. Like I said, fucking Blood Money, he definitely had talent, man. He was uh, he just signed a $50,000 contract with Keith. So people are definitely jealous, man. Um, and like I said, man, whoever killed him, obviously it wasn't worth it though, because both of them ended up getting killed within a month. So let me know who y'all want to see next. I just wanted to bust this one out quick, uh, while we were on the topic, but, uh, yeah, man, hit that like button, uh, comment below, give me some feedback and, uh, don't forget to subscribe, man. It's your boy Boss Mun. Until next time, be safe out there in Chirac.